Hey what is up guys, welcome back to another Minecraft Java video. Today we're going to take a look at how to save, backup and restore your Minecraft Java worlds. And I'm going to show you how to do that in two methods and it's really easy. And if you've ever wanted to back up and save your Minecraft Java world and then restore it at a later date, hopefully this should help you. Okay, so let me go into the main menu and I'll show you how to do it. So if we click on single player and if you come to this screen where we can select your worlds, if you click on the world you want to back up and save, click on the edit button here. Now you will see there is a button that says make backup. So we're going to click this button here and you should see a message pop up on the top right here and it says backed up and then it will give you the name and size of your new world. Now if we go back, we click on our world and then click on edit and then if we go back to this screen and if we click on the open backups folder now as you can see it has backed up the world which I was on and it's going to rename the zip file to the date and time for when you saved it and if we open the zip file you can see that it's got a folder inside it and the second method to actually save your world is to actually go back into the Minecraft directory and another way to go into your Minecraft directory is to actually quit out of the game, open up your Minecraft launcher, go into the installations section here, just hover over where it says latest release and then just click on this folder icon in the same line where it says latest release and it should open up your default Minecraft directory. Now, if we go and look for a folder that says saves, as you can see here, it says saves, double click on this folder. You will see that I do have my worlds here and we do have these folders over here. And the world which I backed up was called new one. And you can either just right click on this, do copy and then paste it into your USB drive or another external hard drive. Or you can right click on this, hover over where it says send to and then click on compressed zip folder or if you've got WinRAR you can add it to a RAR file. So let's go ahead and zip up this folder. There we go. And as you can see I've now got a zip file which when I open it should contain the world folder. Now to restore your world is also quite easy. So let me just delete this new one world folder and I'm going to go back into my Minecraft directory then I'm going to go into the backups folder over here and this is the world which we backed up. We're going to double click on this and now if we go back into the saves folder I'm just going to drag this new one folder into there and there we go. So as you can see I've now got my new one world folder back into my Minecraft saves folder. Just going to close this down and if I launch the game again I should have the world ready for me to play so you can do it both ways guys, you can either use the backup tool within the Minecraft game or you can manually do it and just copy the folder in the saves directory or you can actually zip it up and put it on your external USB drive or any other folder wherever you want to save it. So let's go to single player and as you can see I've got my new one world here, I'm going to click on play and there we go, so it's loaded us back into the game and we can continue playing this game. So Hopefully you guys have found this video useful and you should be able to now back up, save and restore your Minecraft Java worlds. If you do have any comments or queries about how to save and back up your Minecraft worlds, do leave them in the comment section below. And please also do subscribe to this channel to help support it help it grow. And I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching.